mic sound good though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's a record yeah, to both y'all in there. Awesome. All right. So we'll just kind of segue back in what we're already talking okay. about. We'll keep the momentum going. <laughs> I'm like, man, that'd be a whole another yeah. whole another hour <laughs> block. <laughs> Nine through seven sugar right there. Mm -hmm. What up, man? It's B Ray and in the studio still we have Mayor Karen Weaver. Thank you for being here. And also Bootleg Ira Dorsey yes, from sir. the Dayton family. Man, things a second ago was getting hot. Oh yeah, <laughs> man. Getting into the, the, the nitty gritty. If you guys just now tuning in, man, we're trying to clear up any controversies, any any questions out there, any drama related to the, the, the whole campaign that's happening right now with the race for um uh, the new candidate for mayor. And we've just been hitting all notes. We've been yeah. talking about the stuff that's been happening, some of the shady things. Yeah. You know, it's been real shady. It's been real shady. And let's get back into that. Before okay. we got off air, we were talking about a few oh, things. Oh yeah, definitely, man. I mean, you know, at, at you, my, my issue, I've been addressing the issue with the mayor about, you know, let's just deal with the truth of the matter, right? Mm. At the end of the day, you know, the, your opponent for, for mayor this election was on city council, played a pivotal role in pushing the vote for us to switch to the Flint River water system. Right, which poisoned us. Which poisoned the whole city. And then, it, and, and, then and then people died. Yes, thirteen people died. Legionnaires. Yes, right. sir. And then expects to ride a white horse right. into and the mayor's to, office wants, and wants represent to be re the people. Wants to be rewarded for helping make the switch to Flint River water. People died, and now you want us to reward you. You should have spoken up. You should have voted no. And if you didn't, you should have come and said something. Right. You never did. Every time I was fighting Governor Snyder. You think he was sitting at the table with me? No, never showed up. But every time the new governor comes, here he comes running up behind her. Well, I don't, I don't need the help now. I needed the help then. But you want to clear everything. You know, you want to wait till everything's cleared up, and then here you come. And, and you just know, to here make you that, come. I want to But make, you had, mm -hmm. you had that vote. Let's make that clear though to the citizens of Flint. Clearly, took us into emergency manager mm -hmm. making bad decisions and wants to talk about some money. You took us into, you helped take us into emergency management, but you want to be the mayor now. You want to be rewarded for helping us lose our voice, losing our democracy, switching to the Flint River water, being poisoned, people dying. Yeah, let's put you in charge. Flint deserves better than that. Flint deserves better than that. That's why we're going to continue to push Flint forward, right. and we're going to continue to support yeah. you and work our butts mm -hmm. off to make sure that Flint has right. the representation that it deserves. Thank you. Thank you. Because we do deserve it. You know, we deserve better than that. You know, it should have never happened. It should have never happened. And, and have you have you heard a public apology or anything of that nature from that side? No, I've been lied on and said I was stealing, remember? Wow. That's what I get. Wow. That's, that's the apology I get. Let's throw her in the mud, but you're the one that helped make the switch. Seven to one. What do we say? BB was the only, only one. one that voted no. One city council. One. One. Wow. But let me, let me run things now. Wow. Jeez, man, what a what a what a mess that's happening with this whole politics. And then I feel like the energy in the city is kind of like it's split down the middle. You know what I mean? That's like, what they want. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's crazy. You know, because because African American people, my people in the city of Flint, don't like getting in messy situations. You know what I'm saying? So they want to muddy the water and make it look as cloudy and messy as possible, so people will stay home and not vote. But we got to be way smarter than that, wiser than that. We got to see through the smoke and mirrors and, and get out and vote. And like I said, who, did, who when when Walling was running against me, who did Neely support? Walling. When Scott was running against me in the recall, who did he support? Scott. Okay. Mm. You know, yeah. It don't take a diploma to see it, man. You know, at the end of the day, you know, I, I believe in the citizens of Flint. I believe in their, their how smart they are. And I believe they know the truth when they hear it. And, they, and, 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 and you out there rubbing shoulders with them, shaking hands and meeting them. They know you. And I think they trust you and believe in you. Well, I, I hope so. You know? I hope so. You know, because I've been, I have been working hard for that. I really have. And so I'm glad we're having this conversation. Yeah. Uh, because people do need to hear this. And I haven't, you know. And, and, and Mayor, you know one thing else I want you to address, if you could, what? please, for me. I, I talk about the unfinished business that we got, to, that Flint has to do. Well, you know what? I'm going to go back to the water for a minute because we talked about what we wanted for people's homes. But people are looking to Flint. It's like they have learned from Flint. And so now we have an opportunity to be a water resource center 
a water resource center because we have learned so much about water, about infrastructure, I mean, which means more jobs, which changes the narrative mm. of what happened in Flint and how we were able to take this crisis and play a bad hand well and make some good things happen. Turn not just, a right, and not just for here, but for the entire country. They're looking at us. You look at source uh, water, that zero mass, where that's technology and water coming together mm -hmm. because, you know, and we said that's uh, Bill Gates, that's, oh, wow. Elon Musk. Uh, Elon Musk. The, the guy yeah. from Virgin Mobile, mm -hmm. uh, the guy from Sprint, Bloomberg, all of these people have put this money into this company where you have the solar panels, and so it takes the water from the air uh, and, and, and it filters it, and it's a chance for us to have a water bottling company, which means more jobs. More jobs. But we're looking at technology and water and Flint Virgin. being the lead for that. I mean, that's something. That's huge. That, that's huge. And so all of these good things are happening. We're talking about more economic development. I told you we were talking about housing, but you think, uh, if, if Mahindra comes, you think about what other jobs are going to happen as a result of that. You know, whether you're talking about restaurants, whether you're talking about spurring secondary jobs to support what they're doing, you know, more housing. It makes all those kinds of things happen when, when you bring these kinds of companies here. So the future for Flynn is great. I keep telling everybody the best is yet to come. That's if right. you think we rocking and rolling right now, you just wait. That's right. I mean, just wait. And I'm going to have him put them song. That's right. <laughs> right. Yeah. Easy. I mean, really, really, because we are. We should be proud. Mm. We should be proud of what we're making that's happen right. here Flint's in the strong. city of Flint. And that's what we keep talking about. Flint strong, moving Flint forward, us coming together instead of always being divided and throwing stuff at each other and talking about each other and bringing each other down. I said, it's time out for that. We don't have time for that. Right. Because when we do that, you look up and something else is gone. Mm -hmm. Something else is gone. You're like, well, what happened? Well, you all so busy fussing and fighting. Right. We took that too. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. You know, yes, a, yes, indeed. And that's a shady game that, that happens with this politics. I'm just glad that you guys came in today. We cleared the air on some things, and I'm pretty sure some people listening, they still don't, you know, they're yeah. still going to feel the way they do. And you know what, though? And our, our mayor is, has an open policy. If mm -hmm. you have questions, she's open. Right. Communicate with her. You know, it ain't like a closed door at City Hall. You know what I mean? We got a down to earth mayor, and she's pushing Flint forward, and and we're gonna keep and, on. And, and we got to fight for those that fight for right. us. Our mayor fighting for us, so we need to get up Thank and you. fight for her. Yeah. And we got plenty of time until the next time you need to vote. So I would love to get you guys back in here again so we can talk about some more stuff. You know, it's going to be more drama. I know. You know, after this, people But I be... still have more to talk about. That's right. Too, yeah, so definitely. we'll be back. We'll be back. We're we'll going to have back. some more conversations. That's right. And it's always a pleasure having thank you here. Thank you. I'm Bootleg, glad to be here. And thank you guys for coming in. Um, when can people expect the, uh, the album? 93 the ID, man. I'm, I'm going to post something real soon. I'm going to try to let them have it by next month. Okay, awesome. Next yeah. month, you heard it here. Mayor, thank you for coming in today. Thank you for having me. And I, I do need to just say thank you to Ira. I have appreciated your voice and your advocacy yes. and your fight. Yep, thank and you. And your fight. It's thank important. You. Appreciate it. And absolutely. Thank you for coming in, clearing the air for any weird, controversial stuff that's <laughs> out there. Trust and believe. Like I said, even though we answer the questions, people are going to pretend like they didn't. Well, I hope it, it cleared so. the air for some people. Yeah, that's I right. So, too. So, we'll come back. Thanks again for coming in. And uh, we'll look forward to get you back in here, uh, uh, you know, down the road. Okay. All right. Appreciate you Thank guys you. for coming in. And we out the door. Peace. Peace. <laughs> awesome. That's what I'm talking about. All right, say bye, y'all. Okay, bye, y'all. Peace, peace, peace. Peace. <laughs> <laughs> bye, y'all. Awesome. That was great. Was that yeah, good? Yeah, yeah. Like that? that was really yeah. good. Yeah, I'm okay, going to make some good. good articles out of that, too